Hi, my name is Tracy Negrete and I'm here with the 2020 Census. I'm here today to show you how to make your very own chalk drawing. We are going to be writing Todos Contamos. I'm going to show you step by step on how to make your very own chalk drawing. Make sure to complete the Census 2020 because everybody counts. To begin your chalk drawing, I started with a sketch just to get a rough idea to know what I wanted to do. Um, I then went and found a nice visible place, maybe somewhere where there's going to be a lot of traffic or a lot of people are going to see the sign. I went and I swept it to get rid of all of rocks and pebbles and debris and I kind of made notches of where I wanted my lines and guides to be. That way it's easier and faster. Um, also a good tip is go ahead and take your chalk and if you dip it in a little bit of water it spreads out the color a little bit more brighter and evenly. Um, also another tip at the end is you can use hairspray and that helps keep the chalk, it settles it in so it lasts a little bit longer. Okay, so step by step, what I did to make my guides is I put a cross, a small cross in the middle of the square that I'm gonna be doing the drawing. And then I do a notch up to the top and a notch here. So kind of you wanna do four guides. And then it's pretty loose, don't worry about getting it precise. So it's just to get you a little rough idea of where you're gonna be. And then I went ahead and drawed like a half moon here and then a half moon here. From there, the, the center cross is gonna give you an idea where you wanna start the very first word and then in the middle will be the second word. So that'll give you a guide on todos contamos. And then at the bottom, you wanna go ahead and put your 2020census.gov and then you can put your hashtag LA Census Chalkathon, hashtag California Students Count. So when you start writing your words, todos contamos, you're going to start the T at the very left hand top of the corner. And it's going to pretty much fill in the shape that you created. And that's going to give you your guide. So go ahead and do the T-O-D-O-S along the guides. And then in the middle, you're going to start the C-O-N-T-A-M-O-S. And you're going to fill in this whole space with words. Then you're going to go ahead and color it in whatever color you like. I went ahead and picked very bright colors, uh, kind of blues to oranges to pinks to give it like a shade. But you can go ahead and choose any color you want. On top, I'm going to add some silhouettes of the community. And from there, we'll do an outer kind of uh, sun rays, rainbow kind of graphics. For the silhouettes of the people, you can go ahead and make a circle for the head and then you can make a square, but turn that square into more of a rounded shape. And then you can go ahead and add the side profile, maybe a nose or a hat. It's really up to you, but you just kind of want to get an overall circle and square kind of shape for the body. Okay, as far as detail work on the letters, you can also outline it in black if you have a black piece of chalk, and then you can highlight it with little white kind of lines. That will also make it uh, give it a 3D effect. Um, for As far as the, the rays, the rays are going to be coming out just behind the silhouettes of people. So you can go ahead and just draw some lines in back. And you really don't have to make it precise, just have fun with it. For hashtags, you want to go ahead and write hashtag LA Census Chalkathon, hashtag CA Students Count, 2020census.gov. Don't forget at the end to go ahead and spray it with a little bit of hairspray. That way it lasts and everyone in the community can see Census 2020.